Hi guys, so this is another review from me. This one is a practical review because I have been using my old glue gun, the wired one, for a while. And uh, my, my family has been borrowing it a lot lately and it's all banged up and I already gave them that one away. So it's a large uh, kind of uh, glue gun. And I bought this one because I, I am surprised that the last time I bought a glue gun, may, it's maybe five years ago and I'm surprised today that to learn that there's a lot of versions of glue gun. And I found this one first because it attracted me that it's a self-standing glue gun meaning it stands on its own but one of the few things I really liked about this one is because ta-da! it's wireless <laughs> so yeah it uses uh, four AA batteries underneath here so it's, it has a warning there so do not open but if I open it later so I just uh, turned it on before I started the video because I wanted to know if the advertised 10 minute mark for this brand that, that is the brand right there it's a Jower brand says 10 minutes on battery and 3 minutes on wire and uh, I cannot unpack this one because uh, they tested it before they gave it to me and as you can see it's working now working now and it's under around 8 between 8 and 10 minutes so it's advertised and this particular model is okay I'm just gonna remove it in the box that's why I can't unpack because they tested it when they gave this to me so it's an S609 from Jower WeCraft okay so it's hot melt glue gun with switch indicator and the one of the funny phrases that I saw there is multiple scene application Okay, improved adhesive performance. So it's a glue gun. It's gonna be adhesive, and you know it uses seven millimeter glue sticks, and it includes three on the package, and and it's holding silicone nozzle and extended trigger and stable base stand. So again, they say here detachable wire, battery or AC power. They could have said uh, probably wireless or cordless, right? So an advertising thing so there you go an image it doesn't explain much at all and some instructions at the bottom so basically uh, if I change the focus here this switch here the upper part when you switch it up it's gonna be going to the battery mode so when you are plugged in it's not gonna use the battery and when you go down it's gonna use the AC so by default you use the AC part and this is what they're talking about the silicone head here so you won't get scalded when you use it so the heat doesn't go much here even if I touch it right now but it's working and it's pretty smooth there yeah so it's around eight minutes to heat it up in on battery I use four double A's and it's working like a dream right now so I like the color as well and it's freestanding so I don't have to find a place to put it in and it includes in the package three glue sticks and this cord here if you want to use it wired and it's gonna be preheat at around three minutes so I advise you put in the glue gun for uh, the glue stick first plug it in it heats up at three minutes turn to the wireless mode yeah so that it goes hotter quicker so right now I just tested it from no cord at all and just turn it on because they tried the cord mode already at the store and I suggest you review a few of this model that they have they also have the one with built-in light ion battery I'm gonna buy it in the future when I need it because right now I'm just uh, buying things that I actually need and reviewing them so that I can suggest to you good buys and this one just costs around 200 pesos which is around give or take maybe around uh, four dollars or five dollars right so yeah four to five dollars depending on the store that you buy it from so that's pretty cheap it's pretty affordable and that's my review for this one and I hope you like it and uh, again continue to subscribe to my channel click the bell icon to follow all of the nice tips that I have uh, I'm focusing on the great buys great reviews things you can do that uh, will save you much time and money so yeah Thanks again for watching.